Short Story 24 The Lost City Once upon a time there was a young boy named Peter who lived in a small village. Peter was a curious boy and he loved to explore the forest near his village. One day Peter was exploring the forest when he came across a strange sight. There was a large hole in the ground and it was filled with a thick mist. Peter had never seen anything like it before. Peter cautiously approached the hole and peered inside. He could not see anything, but he could hear a faint sound of music. Peter was intrigued, and he decided to climb down into the hole. As Peter descended, the mist grew thicker. He could no longer see the ground, and he could barely breathe. Peter was starting to feel scared, but he kept going. Finally, Peter reached the bottom of the hole. He found himself in a strange and beautiful city. The buildings were made of gold and silver, and the streets were paved with jewels. Peter had never seen anything like it before. Peter wandered through the city, amazed by everything he saw. He met strange and wonderful creatures, and he heard even stranger stories. Peter felt like he had stepped into another world. After a while, Peter started to feel tired. He found a bench to sit on, and he closed his eyes. When he opened his eyes, he was back in the forest. He had been dreaming. Peter never forgot his dream of the lost city. He often wondered if it was real, or if it was just a figment of his imagination. But one day, Peter decided to go back to the forest and see if he could find the hole again. Peter searched the forest for hours, but he could not find the hole. He was about to give up when he saw something strange. There was a faint glow coming from the ground. Peter dug at the spot and soon he uncovered the hole. Peter climbed down into the hole and he found, found himself back in the lost city. He was so happy to be back and he knew that he would never forget this place. Peter spent the next few days exploring the city. He met new friends and he learned about the city's history. Peter was so happy that he had found this place. One day Peter decided that it was time to go home. He said goodbye to his friends and he climbed back up the hole. When he reached the top, he was back in the forest. Peter never forgot his time in the lost city. He often thought about it and he wondered if he would ever go back. But he knew that even if he never went back, he would always have the memories of his time there.